Hey everyone, let me ask you this straight question to each one of you out there. How many of class 11 and 12 students feel that doing engineering and medical is only the prestigious aspect? Or if you are a parent, how many of you feel that it's engineering or medical which are demanding? That can make your child earn more money. If you are feeling this, then you are so much ignorant. Hurry up and be alert. Times have changed. The world is changing a lot. Nothing to do with a degree. Skill matters a lot. Hey everyone, this is Nalini ma'am. In this video, I am going to unfold the beautiful courses which are there and the beautiful entrance examinations that you have to write after 12th standard and this video is also for class 10 students if you are planning to take up a science stream this video will help you to understand what other courses do exist along with engineering and medical these courses are no less than any engineering or medical if you can complete these courses your life can be much better than any engineer. Do you know, 25 lakh people are appearing for NEET where the seats are only 1 lakh. What about the 24 lakh students who have not got the medical seats? Do you think are they incapable? No, God has better plans for you all. 86% of the engineers are unemployed. That is what the statistics are saying. Okay, do you want to be there in that category? No, right? So guys, in this video, I am going to talk about the beautiful entrance examinations, the wonderful courses that you have and these courses, if you do, you can settle and you can have the opportunities like anything else. The skill matters a lot. Again, I am stressing out. Okay, so let us figure out what all the entrance exams are there that you can focus to write after your 12th standard. Okay, first and foremost, let me talk about the first entrance exam. This is my favorite entrance exam. I always recommend this entrance exam also for all my class 11 and 12 students actually that is IAT which means that ICERS aptitude test okay so what is ICERS by the way ICERS are nothing but Indian Institute of Science Education and Research which we will call it as ICERS okay so ICERS is the short form we use and ICER aptitude test is the entrance exam that you have to crack if you want to get into the ICERs. So where are the ICERs present? ICERs are present in Bairampur, Bhopal, Kolkata, Mohali, Pune, Tiruvananthapuram and Tirupati. Just like IITs, you have 23 IITs located in different places of country. Just like that, you have these ICERs located in how many places? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. So in 7 places of a country, you have this beautiful institutes called ICERs. Okay. So all these are the different logo, logos of these places. See, Aisar Pune is a very, very famous Aisar. Okay, so Aisar Kolkata, right? So all these are the institute. In short, we call them as Aisars. Okay, Indian Institute of Science, Education and Research. So what course you can register? What is the course that you can do? That is five-year BSMS program, which is just equivalent to MSc. It's like you are completing your research. Okay, so Bachelor of Science, MS means Master of Science. So it's a five years powerful integrated course, which is more than 10 times. It has more weightage than engineering guys. 
okay so in nowadays actually the students who qualified from icers are getting better job opportunities 10 times better job opportunities than uh, the people who have qualified engineering okay so let me tell you more details of this entrance exam when do you write this entrance exam just soon after completion of your class 12 board examination okay what is the syllabus it is that ncrt syllabus only okay and is the question paper hard not at all okay the level of the question paper is actually in between neat and je guys okay so the question paper is little tougher than neat but slightly easier than je okay so that is the level of the question paper so now let me give you the details of uh, you know this iit more details of iit and along with the seven icers you can also get into the bs program okay so you have a bachelor in science program at iisc this is the world's renowned institution which is located in india okay so indian institute of science okay the very very prestigious institute my favorite institute which is located in bangalore so you can go for this graduate degree uh, in iisc through IIT itself, through this entrance exam called IIT itself. And if you can crack this IIT, you can also get into IIT Madras for which course? For BS Medical Sciences and Engineering program. Okay, so even IIT Madras is also taking students through IIT, not just JE Advanced. Okay, IIT Madras is taking students uh, who have cracked IIT okay so that is the power of this entrance exam guys actually these are 2024 dates but more or less on the same dates you might have the entrance exam for 2025 batch also okay so you should keep on checking its website okay uh, from april onwards so that you will get to know the dates of 2025 2025 dates are not yet released and it will be uh, opened soon anytime soon uh, in February okay so what I recommend you is uh, keep on checking this website okay just google the word IAT and uh, you know keep on checking the website for the further updates but these are the different time zones uh, you know I have given you for the 2025 examination right so you have good number of days to prepare yar see uh, the questions in IAT are more conceptual okay if if you are thorough with the concepts you can easily crack the questions especially the chemistry and if you want a concept clarity on all the concepts you have my beautiful courses class 11 chemistry and class 12 chemistry where concepts can become cluster clear if you are interested you can just go to the description and check out with the link that i have provided don't miss out guys they are the beautiful courses fine so these are the different uh, time zones about this entrance exam called iat now coming to the next entrance examination another powerful entrance exam nest we say so what is nest national entrance screening test okay so this entrance exam is the entrance exam to get into which institute in short we call the institute as nicer previously it was icer but this is a nicer so what is a nicer national institute of science education and research this is nicer where is it present it is present in bhuvaneshwar okay so and not only that through this entrance exam, you can get admission into University of Mumbai, uh, which is associated in the University of Mumbai. You have a department for atomic energy. Okay, so it's a uh, department of atomic energy is a very powerful center in the University of Mumbai and also in our country. Okay, and to that prestigious uh, undergraduate course, you can get admission if you can qualify this entrance exam called NEST. Okay, so again here, what is the syllabus? The same NCRT, the same syllabus that you are preparing for JE and NEET. Okay, and if 
you ask me the time zones of uh, uh, this particular entrance exam that is NEST, look over here. They have already released the dates. Online application opens, you know, uh, on 17th February 2025 and applications will get closed by 9th May. Okay, and uh, you also can go for the mock test uh, papers here and date of examination is 22nd June 2025 that is on Sunday. So even for this entrance examination, you have good number of days to prepare guys. So take your time and uh, please do consider these entrance examinations also. Okay, you can get into the powerful courses which are more than more than engineering. Okay. So that is about next entrance examination. Next, let me also talk about the courses which are related to design and architecture. Okay, so nowadays designing courses are in trend. Designing in the sense it's not about fashion designing, designing cloth, uh, designing textiles. No, it's about designing models. Okay, so it's about uh, design is completely a, in every field there is a concept of design actually okay so even in the technology also there is a concept of design here designing chips designing uh, gadgets okay so designing technology so there is there actually there is a very different meaning for designing right so all those varieties of designing courses are very very beautiful and very very demanding nowadays Okay, so this is the skill if you can acquire in 2025 and uh, so on. I mean, in the further years, you will be the ruling the industry. Okay, so you will be ruling the industry. So keep my points in your mind. Guys, what are the entrance exam that you are supposed to write to get into these uh, designing courses? Okay, so you have you have bachelor in design. Okay, so uh, the the entrance exam this is very famous most of them actually will give this entrance exam that is nata national aptitude test in architecture okay and you also have another entrance exam called uc undergraduate common entrance examination for design okay so guys uh, if you can crack this entrance exam you can get into b design and you know what designing institutes there are I think six to seven designing institutes just like IITs which are there in our country. Okay, so if you can get into those institutes, the life will change forever here. Okay, so please go for these courses also uh, which are in high demand nowadays. Okay, fine. So these are the different courses that I would like to talk here guys. So what I meant to tell you is go for the courses which interest you okay so in which you have interest okay see now you are in a position and now you have got that age to decide what is right for you what is bad for you say i agree after 10th you will not be having that age and awareness to decide the stream your parents will help most of the time but after 12th, the scene is not like that. The scenario is not like that. Now you are in a position to decide what you want. Okay, find out your Ikigai. Do you know the concept of Ikigai? Ikigai is a Japanese word, isn't it? So Ikigai in the sense, follow your... It, it's all about passion. Follow your passion. Okay, what, what makes you to get up in the morning every day? Okay, what motivates you? Okay, uh, what are the things you enjoy the most? Identify these things. Identifying the purpose of your life is all about this word Ikigai. Okay, so find out your Ikigai. That means find out your purpose. Identify your interest and then select a suitable course and uh, you know, if you are doing any course, see that you are doing it in a very good college. That matters a lot. College matters a lot. Sometimes uh, people go with the simple degrees like BCA, Bachelor in Computer Application, uh, you know, BBA, right, BSc. Uh, they, they, they do it in a very good college where they will get lot of skills. 
okay so i have a situation where bba bcom student with lot of skilling have got placed for 9 to 10 lakhs per annum package where an engineering graduate is not getting more than 4 lakh or 5 lakh per annum year okay see a bba graduate is getting 9 and a half to 10 lakh uh, per annum package right so it is all about the skill no matter your degree can be simple even these degrees are wonderful and beautiful degrees can seem simple but what skill you have right that will help you to get the job nowadays nowadays it's not about what degree you're doing nowadays it's all about what skill you're acquiring in your undergraduate uh, time okay so that matters a lot so that's all about the video guys so if you have got benefit at least little benefit from the video please share the videos to your friends okay so let everybody get to know about these entrance exam and let everybody get to know and think about what is their ikigai okay and if you know your ikigai comment your answer in the comment section and i want you to post okay so if you have come to this far uh, my videos are attracting you and please subscribe and share the videos to others and also please share your takeaways uh, what what you learned in a video okay so thank you so much see you in the next video <music>